It's easy to stay inside when you have beautiful flowers like this. But I decided to step outside to take some uh, fresh air to look at the trees as I'm going to talk with you about parts of a plant. We have the root system and the shoot system. The plant is a living organism that makes its own food and it's adapted to living on land. The root system, it's adapted to soil. In the shoot system, it's adapted to air. And um, the water does the job, but not for long. That's why we have, we came outside to see the grass and to observe the trees. Their roots are deep in. And when we look at the grass, they are not subdependent. We'll go in a different conversation later on about types of roots. The root system absorbs water and minerals from the soil. The water and the minerals are transported through vascular bundles from the root system to the shoot system. So the root system supports the plant in the soil and um, the root system actually is made out of the roots only. The shoot system of the plant is adapted to air and you could see that. Trees are not falling down as they are well established into the soil supported by the root. Okay. The shoot system uses carbon dioxide and the light energy of the sun and the water and minerals from the root system. The shoot system includes the stems, the leaves, the flowers, and the fruit of the flower. And later on we will gonna ha go on to a discussion of um, the fruit and the seeds. As um, we look at the stems, the stems uh, are a part of the shoot system of the plant and they transport water and minerals from the root system to all parts of the shoot systems, to leaves and flowers. The stems also transport the food produced in the shoot system to the root system for use and for storage, the stems also support the leaves. Looking at the leaves, they are part of the shoot system as well of the plant. They use the carbon dioxide and the energy of the sun from the air and the water and minerals from the root system to make food for plant. and the flower. The flower will contain the fruits, the fruit of and also inside there is the seeds and I can't wait to tell you a little bit more. We were gonna go and analyze different types of roots later on. We will talk about the function of the flowers and leaves in a different video. I hope you enjoyed my flowers.